Okay, here we go. Art. Let's take a look. I think we're here. No. I think we're here from Beach Raptor. There's Jill Ballantyne from The Thing. You know the thing. It's cool. I like this. You have a good style, Beach Raptor. Keep it up. Keep up the good work. Not that you needed me to tell you that. That's the thing. Jill from the thing. Sorry, not the thing, the movie. I'm sorry. It's just it's late. I'm tired. Uh it's good. That's a recurring theme here on the Buru segment. People are like, why is this guy always tired when he's showing when he's doing his videos? Maybe he should like, could you imagine there are people that only watch the full sauce channel, just the Buru segments, and that's it? Like, what, what's this guy doing? He always starts his streams when he's tired. Clay Z made this. Here's a BRB with some meat, including the cursed tape. Vinny ever experimented with art to start the stream? Well, that would mean that I'd have to, uh, you know, go from last night's art forward, which would make it you know, I'd, less relevant, I suppose. It, it, I mean, yeah, it could work, but it's whatever. Klutschke made this. Some art from Moons of Madness. It's also a good way to wind down after a, a night of death in video games. Especially when, you know, crabs are destroying people. But, nice Moons of Madness art. Here's one from Cheesy Draws. I don't know about you, chat, but my favorite video game instrument is the butt trumpet. I'm wearing a Jape t-shirt. <laughs> yes! Actually, Resident Evil has done the, just that. Well, maybe not the version I'm playing, but you know which one. There's a butt trumpet. Don't worry about it. Anyway. Here's one from Shanguin. It is Variety is Hope. So, I'll be participating in this. Um, this is really cool art. It's just, uh, I'll be doing one stream, one game, nothing crazy. It's just a Variety is Hope thing to help out with the organization so that they can do more stuff for future charity streams and for the charity stream next year. So, join if you want. You don't have to. But I will be uh, playing, doing a couple hours Saturday night. If you want to watch, if you want to help out, if you want to just watch, that's fine too. Whatever you want to do. But it is something that I think will um, really help out future charity streams. And again, I defer to the main man himself, Hootie. But that'll be Saturday. We'll, you know, figure all that out. I'll just be streaming a spoopy channel, a uh, spoopy game for you. I'm going to keep it, uh, I think it should be on the schedule by now, and if it's not, it will be soon. But I do have, um, the game I'll be streaming, it's a Half-Life 2 mod. And it's kind of cool, it's like Silent Hill. It's called Alchemilla? 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 So, it's a, I mean, the theme of the thing is spooky games, so I figured this looks kind of cool. And, uh... Is Half-Life and Silent Hill. So you kind of can't beat that. Here's one from K-Frey. Yeah, God, I hope it's not Cry of Fear as well. That's the name of the hospital from Silent Hill 1. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, it got recommended. People seem to like it. K-Frey made this. Eat Weed. This is some art for, you know, another light. It's the cover. So, nice work there.
This one's from Jukuls, J-O-O-Q-L-Z. Every time I have to figure out how to pronounce that, because... Oh, it's just Jules. The, the Q is silent. <laughs> but it's some vine shrooms, it's some dark shrooms, it's cool. Nice work. Lots of different shrooms. Eli made some Final Fantasy IX art. A little belated, but... It's pretty great. Lots of love and attention was put into this. And I really appreciate this work. Um, Steinman looks amazing. I mean, they all do, but... It's just great. It's a shame Amaranth has to be in this game to take up all the space at the top. <laughs> Kidding. No, he's fine. He's just fine. Death Amps made this. It is, um... Me brewing up a witch's brew. Oh, that's cool. What would the effects be? You know what? It would be... You'd be forgetful. You would forget everything. Because that's exactly what I suffer from. So you just forget. It's just... Severe memory loss. Again, my defense of my memory loss is... Um, it's several... It's, I think it's several things, but one not to be underestimated is, for me at least, the fact that I stream every night. It's like there's so much sensory input every day of my life. So I usually kind of chalk that up to, um, it's like the hard drive space. It just gets overwritten. I mean, there's some things I do remember, and some things I don't. It's weird. Yet I can hear a song in my dreams and wake up and play it. So that's cool. Here's one from Carnomancer. Lack of sleep may worsen your memory. I sleep quite a bit, actually. That's one of the um, misconceptions about me, because, first of all, this is art that I love from Faith, which that video of Faith 1 and 2 was uploaded today, and I thought that was fantastic, by the way. But, uh, yes, this is great art, and it is just as creepy as it's supposed to be, so nicely done here. But um, because I, I sleep and stream, I stream really late and get to bed really late, and people have, obviously not everyone, but... Over the years, I've gotten some assumptions that I don't get enough sleep. Which, as I've always tried to dispel that myth, I get like eight to nine hours every night. Once a month, I may have a shitty night's sleep. Where I'm just up staring at the ceiling for no good reason. But otherwise, I value and guard my sleep. Like, I'm pretty... You know, it's important. And it's something that I think is is the key to some of my um, creativity, if if there is such a thing in there. Um, yeah, it's good, and I make sure I can get it when I can, and you know, really work on those eight hours if I can get eight. If not, seven will you know do okay too. I did know someone that had to sleep like eleven hours every night. I'm like, well. What if you get eight? They're like, no, I can't wake up too groggy. So, Carnomancer, nice work here. I think we're winding down the art segment tonight. Death Metal Alley made this. I hope this isn't Chris's blood. Weird, it tastes like pigeon milk. <laughs> but you gotta taste the blood, you find out who it is. VR Josh made something for us. I'd like to be under the sea in a little Cthulhu's garden in the shade.
That's really great, VR Josh. Nice work. Good combo of things, too. As always, I'm impressed by your 3D VR work. Let's see. Well, that appears to be it. Thank you, everybody, for watching. And I hope you all have a good night. And I will see you... I'll see you tomorrow with um, Resident Evil. And who knows what else. I think I might have some ideas of what I could be streaming. Remember, Noita should be showing up again sometime this week. But... There's something else I promised for this week. And I hate that I promised it. But anyway, good night. See you tomorrow. Uh, Twitch.tv slash team slash vinesauce, vinesauce.com. Or wait here for the auto host for more streamers. If you like what I do, if I'm not around, if you're looking for some other streamers that you may enjoy, remember the choice is yours at the end of the day. You don't have to stick around here, there, or anywhere if you don't want to. Which is why I say check out some other streamers. You might want to throw them a sub. You might want to follow them. You might want, want to do nothing. Nothing. No more fan mail. Whatever the case is, you can wait here. Auto Host will take you to a bunch of good streamers. My mods who put a lot of effort into helping me out on this channel. And um, other good friends. So, good night. And I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.